perhaps you're a musician and you're wondering whether you could use your Raspberry Pi 4 as a digital audio workstation. The answer is absolutely. Here we have LMMS version 1.2 running on a Raspberry Pi 4. LMMS is a digital audio workstation that's available for Linux systems. Now to be clear, you won't find this version in the default PyOS repository. The version that you get in the default repository, in my opinion, is not quite as usable. So you'll have to download the source code from GitHub and compile it for yourself. Now the instructions for compiling provided in the GitHub repository won't work unmodified. If you follow the provided instructions verbatim, you'll error out when compiling. Now the following instructions I'm about to give you run the risk of completely messing up your system. So if you're unwilling to take that risk, do not proceed further. Here's what you need to do different in order to successfully compile LMMS 1.2 on your Raspberry Pi 4. Before we start, we'll have to download all the required dependencies. Here's the list. You can look it up in the description to this video below and use that. With that out of the way, we'll start by git cloning the source code from its GitHub repository. We do this by issuing the following command. git clone recurse submodules dash b stable 1.2 followed by the URL. Once Git has done its job, you will get a subdirectory called LMMS. CD into that. Now with the source code downloaded, you'll have to make some modifications to the CMake file. So let's just edit that. You'll have to make changes to the lines that specify the compiler flags to ones that are specific for the ARM processor on the Raspberry Pi 4. So here are the flags that you'll need to modify, the ones that I've highlighted here. Now just do this, then save. We then create a build directory and then cd into that. And allow CMake to create the make files for us. The options that we'll give CMake are the following. Dash D1 QT5 equals to on, which means that we would like to use Qt5 for the interface and dash D want VST off because the Raspberry Pi 4 is unable to execute Intel code. CMake will then create the make files that you require to actually start compiling the source code. Now that CMake has done its job, we'll issue the make command make dash j3 please note that i'm using the 4 gigabyte version of the raspberry pi 4 so i'm not sure whether the compiling it proceeds smoothly if you have the 1 gigabyte version now that compiling is finished we can proceed to install lmms to the default location by issuing sudo make install 
But before you do that, to prevent problems and completely messing up everything, if you have previously installed the official repository version of LMMS using app install, you'll have to uninstall that. Now we are ready to issue the install command. So just type sudo make install. I've already done this, so I'm not going to do that again. If everything works, you will be able to find LMMS in your main Pi menu or you can just launch it from the terminal by typing LMMS. Now let's just sit back and enjoy some music.